hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is togozani Klaba for those who are new and for my current subscribers thank you so much for coming back today i'm gonna be showing you how i use my my mac studio foundations i spoke a little bit about these in my part one makeup collection my project pan video and also my mac video which if you have not seen those i will link them above so let's let's get into it what you have to do is you're gonna put a few drops of each color and then you're gonna mix it with the back of any brush or if you have like a makeup spatula you can use that i don't have exact measurements of how many drops do i put i'll kind of see as i go how much is enough so i'm gonna take a pedal brush like that and I'm gonna use it to paint the product onto my face. If I feel like I need a bit of um, either both colors or one of them after I've already applied to my face, I'll just add that on. I'm gonna wait maybe 30 seconds and then I'll start blending. And I'm doing that because it's gonna help give me a little bit more coverage. On one side, I'm gonna blend with my beauty blender and on the other, I'm gonna use a brush so we can see if there's any difference in coverage and finish. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see but I think the sponge takes a bit of product off on the face because it seems like there's more coverage this side than there is there I think because this foundation is so like watery the sponge really soaks up that liquid I think so I do prefer um, I prefer the brush for this foundation so I think to balance that off I'm just gonna add a little bit more product on this side so everything can match so this is what it looks like it's really natural you, you can still see my scar and like my skin showing through very glowy so if you like more of a matte finish i recommend that you bake and use a mattifying powder i did use powder but not not a lot and i really love so i'm gonna go to the mac website and i'm gonna read so that is it on the website and let's read what they say about it okay they describe it as a comfortable lightweight fluid foundation with a unique blend of emollients that delivers sheer buildable coverage and a satin finish. The moisturizing long wear formula glides onto face and body, providing stay true color. And I totally agree with that. Yeah, it's very comfortable. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing makeup. You know, sometimes foundation, like you can feel that you're wearing foundation and I don't feel, I don't feel this at all. It's lightweight, yeah, and it delivers a sheer, a sheer buildable 
coverage so if you want to get a bit more coverage you use more product but if you really want to have it nice and sheer then you just use a small amount mac definitely understood the assignment on this foundation i really love it sells for 520 for the 50 mils but i didn't pay anything for mine like i said in my other videos my sister gave these foundations to me so thank you sissy so they have it in the 50 mil size and they also have it in the 120 mil size which retails for 650 so that is my review of the mac face and body foundation totally recommend okay so thank you for watching my video guys and i'll see you next time